Hello and welcome to Sestia Rank, and today I'm playing more Armor Core 6, Fires Rubicon. Let's go ahead and hop in for the day. I think where we left off, we had completed the arena stuff, yep, and needed to look into doing another mission. So we're on a whole new set of Chapter 3, Eliminate Honest Brute, Contaminate Zone Grid 12, Destroy Enemy AC, Eliminate Honest Brute and Doser. Or Dozer hiding out in grid 12. Extra rewards based on number of enemies destroyed. I'll cut to the chase. This is about the Ice Worm, that institute relic you had a run in with. The corpse might stand a chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Coral Tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. But I'll need your help. You'll be heading to Grid 012. One of the first sectors they built. And it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed R.A.D. is hiding out. Goes by the name of Honest Brute. His A.C. Milktooth was built by us, so it's only flaws that it's piloted by him. When he ran from R.A.D., he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project of mine. That secret project is what we'll need to bust open the Ice Worm shield. Okay, sounds like an interesting mission. You ready for this, tourist? No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain. Here we go. Main system, activating combat mode. All right, tourist. I'll tell you where to go. Welcome, tourist. It's a delight to enjoy the company of a visitor from so far away. Brute, we're here to take back what you stole from us. Oh, heavens. You're a friend of Carla's. Splendid. Any friend of Carla's is a friend of mine. Here's to new beginnings. By all means, be my guest. See what I mean, tourist? We need to go deep down. I'm gonna take my time since it's my first time on this mission. Look around a little bit in case there's a new chest or something. Oh, where is this guy? Oh yeah, I forgot I swapped. Uh, which side is... Explosive, and which one is a assault rifle? Pretty sure I beat Preet with this setup. Hmm, don't see anything yet. Ah, here's a little guy. Where's the other one at? Oh, there's at least one other guy out here. Where are you at? There we go. There we go. Shaking it nice and slow. Okay, our next step is down that way, I believe. And I see a lot of lasers in the area. I wonder what these guys are up to. Interesting. Um. Maybe there are tripwires? This looks like something collectible. Make sure you keep clear of the laser sensors. You're set to activate the enemy machines. A new friend from afar, just for me. What joy. Be still my beating heart. Okay, well, 
I guess I'll just leave him there. Yeah. Ah, hit me in there. Nice. Wonder if I activate one while they all activate. Hey, for 8400, I'm gonna take my time and blow them all up. Oh, another one activated. Okay, so far so good. so we can get some more money. Right hand ammunition at 50%. <laughs> Alright, let's see. How about this level? It does have a combat log. That area over there looks like it could be an excellent place. Pawn 1 2, actually. There might be a fight springing up when I get down here, though. I'm waiting for you, friend. Fidgeting anxiously before the big dance. It looks like an enemy to fight over that way. I'll check it out here in a minute. Hey, more of these guys. At least I think. Oh, interactive. They do a little bit better, it looks like. I'm still betting there's something up here though. Let's explore a little bit more. Okay. Maybe it's whatever that thing that was sitting over the other way was. We'll catch up to it and take it down. Let's go see about this guy, this tetrapod. Oh, that's taking some hits. Looks like this have a combat log in the it too. Son of that shield. Uh oh. There's your way in. Bro can't be far. We should keep an eye out for shots. They'll be much more dangerous to take hold of. Yeah, 
There we go. AP at 30%. Guess we'll use a heal. Wouldn't be surprised if there's a resupply based on how long this mission's going. Oh, interesting. Right shoulder ammunition at 50%. Lots more enemies. Let's do a manual aim and take out one or two of them. Uh, Truller is just sensitive enough of missing. Right hand ammunition. I've done my best to welcome you. I do hope you'll enjoy your stay, friend. Okay, who else is there? Oh, another thing to pick up. Cool. See what's striking me. I guess we're just gonna keep making our way down. Ah, that's what it is. Look like a pretty big area. No resupply either. Let's go see. Can I get over here? Looks like I can. Ah, oh, it's a world boundary. Darn. Yeah, it's not gonna let me get any closer. Is this place some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Interesting. Very confined. What are rays lurking? Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Brute! Ah, oh, Carla. You've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. Ah, oh, yeah, this is the same tour already we did in the. Uh, arena. I knew we fought on, but I couldn't know which one he was. This might be hard with my explosive rounds. But, we'll try. again. It's dodging my missiles pretty well, fortunately. Uh, just my shoulders and this assault rifle. It's not looking good. Oh, and he healed too. Yeah, definitely don't think we'll be able to make this one. Oh yeah. Let's see. 
Not bad considering how much ammo I started out with. I'm surprised there wasn't a supply sherpa. Okay. Well, that's no surprise considering I uh, hardly any ammo. We'll take them out this next time really easily. Jump down there. We've got him cornered. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. I swear it seems faster to fall than it is to use boosters putting it down. Of some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Ah, that's how he comes in. Yeah, this will be over soon. I think they're just not good. I had to use a repair kit. Oh yeah, I forgot he did the repair too. So yeah, that's what I need to, I think, no matter what. Shoot. He's getting some hits on me. His flamethrowers can eat up my missiles. But it seems like I should have been connecting with more of this. Is that close? This is a gift. Woo. Thank you. Enemy AC is silent. Looks like he's dead. Good. All right, tourist. I'll see about retrieving our secret project. We'll need it to go worm hunting. Well, that's bizarre. You don't get a supply drop on that one. Okay, cool. The double trouble. No, oh, cool. It's a chainsaw. And a bad cook. Oh, sweet. My Alpha Core. Sweet. Got a lot of neat stuff. One new mess. 
This is Chatty Stick. Oh, hey, Unigram. Thanks for putting down Brute. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon. And I've never seen her happier to be at work. That is all. Later, tourist. <laughs> okay, let's see. Wanted to see about the mine off the legs. Are they for sale or were they? I've already fully unlocked them. Looks like I have. So let's go check out our AC design. And here's our mind alpha. How does it change things up? Weight's a good improvement. Um, not a huge, huge drop in defenses. I actually like it. The boost speed goes up a little bit too. Hmm. Might actually go ahead and try it. And let's see. There's a chainsaw and something else. Um, which I believe I have to actually buy them. The bad cook. Or maybe not. Let's see. Ah, uh, there it is. The bad cook. Yeah. Ah, uh, it takes down thermal defenses. Okay. I see. The range is pretty big, too. I just don't know if I'd like it or not, but I might try it. Anyways, we'll just go ahead and give it a shot. And what about the chainsaw? That may have been what I picked up, actually, so I can equip it over in my AC design area. Oh, yeah, it has the new game plus. Oh, we got bad cook on both sides. Uh, let's see if we've got the chainsaw on the other. Oh, I haven't equipped this Princetsu yet either. Maybe we'll try that combo and then we'll look for the chainsaw later. Actually, both of these. Let's uh, get that other weapon. Is the chainsaw a shoulder mount? Oh, cool. Sounds like it's a lot of fun. Oh, there we go. The double trouble. We'll give it a try. Flamethrower and a chainsaw. Be pretty terrifying if that was coming after me. <laughs> Alright. Let's check out the next mission. Old Bertram Spaceport. Defend the base. Defend the old spaceport and prevent its recapture by the Planetary Closure Administration. Nice. Got a job for you, 62. request comes from our subsidiary Schneider. It concerns the Bertram spaceport, which you and V4 brought under our control. We've received intel that a stranded PCA fleet is planning to retake the base. Your objective is to intercept the PCA and defend the spaceport. We've deployed an MT squad to support you. Use them as you see fit. That concludes the briefing. Good luck. All right, here we go. The PCA are going to be fighting to win. Six to one. Don't forget you have an MT backup. A lot of new equipment, so we'll see how it performs. May not be appropriate for this mission, but we'll see. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Wait, something's not right, 621. Hmm. The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. Seems a far ways out. Look around a little bit while we're. Making our way over there just to see if we can find something. Not boundaries already. Hmm. I wonder if the ice worm made its way up here. This feels like a definite boss fight.
Do you read me, Raven? I've identified the target. That's the mercenary who took your name. Let's see how far they can fly. On borrowed wings. That's a pile driver. And I have a chainsaw. Not for that. Wow. Oh no, I need to get here Stuff for this guy, he's fast. Woo! Big fight. That pilot just wiped out a PCA squad. Stay sharp, 61. He's your tip, Walter. <laughs> ah, if I could just hit him with that chainsaw. Woo! Wow. Man, he's a stone cold killer. Let's see. We'll adjust our AC a little bit. I don't think that the flamethrower is going to be a help. Um, and I want to get to maybe medium range overall. And let's see, is that the best one for it? Yeah, yeah, really. Uh, let's see. I'd be overburdened with that. And about this one. What does it get us? Metallic explosive defense. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll end up switching out for that. Uh, let's see. How else would we want to do this? No, I want to get rid of the bad cook. Let's try something else. I don't think that pulse gun's going to make a difference. Plasma rifle might do nicely. And I don't know if the chainsaw is going to be fast enough. I might swap out for the stun baton. Maybe if I hit him with that, that would work. Actually, let's do the sweet 16. I think projectiles are going to be what rule this fight. And what about a vertical missile launcher? Ooh, that one has a lot of impact. There we go. We'll go with that. And how about on the left side? What else do we want? Maybe a vertical. Okay. I may have to swap out the core, but we'll see. Main system activating combat mode. Definitely tough one. Seems to be doing okay with them in the current way, though. Ooh. 
Ooh, big hits. Vertical launchers seem to be a weakness in phase. Oh, missed that stun. And I ran into a shield. Oh, he healed again too. Wow. Oh, I'm already out of uh, my right plasma. Wow. Ooh. I'm not sure what the key to this one is. He was tough. Uh, I try one of my cheek builds just to see if I can mow him down. He is unbelievably tough. Pretty fitting for such a cool name to Raven. Alright, let's see. Two songbirds. <laughs> see if that'll make it. Keeping the gat on them too might give us some uh, stagger stagger that we'll have a chance. The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. It's so hard to beat a heavy build on this game, like at least for me, like I needed the defense. <laughs> Got the healing factor. Oh, don't let him get you. Another kill. Shoot. Holy moly. Another round. Man. Holy moly. Alright, let's see what we can do. We'll go full uh, tank tread mode here. I also wonder if he would be susceptible to tetrapod. Because I have a feeling he might. I think I want to swap out one of my wep one of my slung birds for a vertical missile launcher. Because he seemed to let himself get hit by those. Okay, and sweet 16 I think wasn't doing me too many favors. Um, I would a flamethrower help? I'm not sure. I'll try the Rensetsu. How about that? Now we're overburdened. Um, maybe tetrapod legs aren't the right way. We'll just go ahead and do tank. Maybe we'll have a good chance of beating it with all the hit points that we're going to have. Or defenses at least. Main system. Activating combat mode. I have a feeling I'll be trying this mission a few times. Wait, something's not right, 621. The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. Alright, so fast. Woo. 
see. Times he's gonna heal. Uh, hopefully, that's the last one. Hit him, hit him. Ah, oh, don't do it, don't do it. Get him. Yes. Sweet. Oh, that was so tough. Wow. My hands were starting to spasm a little bit by the end of it. <laughs> Oof. No new messages. I looked into the other Raven, the independent mercenary who attacked you. It turns out that Raven isn't an individual call sign. It's a title. Passed down generations of mercenaries who champion the free will Raven stands for. They choose what to fight for, and take to the skies in flight. If that's what being Raven means, then that's the name I want to keep calling you. Raven. Oh, awesome. I might put that sticker on. Okay. Sweet. Let's uh, see if we got time for one more mission, perhaps. And I do think I'd like to change out my AC, but we'll do it once we get in the sortie mission. Historic data recovery. Centralized field. Ningerbret tunnel. Retrieve data. Salvage historic data scattered throughout the subterranean tunnel. No base pay. Compensation derived from saleable data recovered from PCA Rex. Interesting. Raven, you're the Raven Mercenary. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. Hmm. 
All right, here we go. I've taken a few liberties. Walter thinks you've gone on a geological survey. Thank you for doing this for me, Raven. Ah, I should have swapped out my AC parts, but I got excited to try the mission. Main system, activating combat mode. Let's get started, Raven. I've already located several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. Weird. Let's see. Yeah, this is not going to do well on this one. Uh, we'll try that. <laughs> Might be comical. Promising the credits. Sending them later. Oh yeah, I have like no boost. Let's see if we can get up here. <laughs> Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. See the nothing up there. Search must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. It's supposed to be what it's like trying to fly around in like a mining cart or something. This is terrible. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, yeah, this is bad enough. I want to switch. <laughs> Let's check in here. We'll do this guy. This should be good enough. And let's see what does it have. A couple launchers, missiles, pulse rifle. Yeah, we'll swap a few things out. I think I want to try out that Red Setsu or Red Etsy. What was it? Let's see. It's on the other arm, I think. Yeah, there we go. Now on this one, we'll do bad cook. All right, and do something like that. And we'll do songbirds, why not? Okay, now let's put on the mind alpha legs, or mind alpha core at least. And same thing with legs. Here we go. Main system activating combat mode. Should be able to move much more swiftly now. Let's get started. Oh yeah. This I've already a lot located better. several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. Did a pretty good job of cooking that guy. PC craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send it to you later. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. I guess the tetrapod legs would be pretty good for this level too with their hover ability. So we'll this one first. That's an old bus, I see. The Rubiconians used to pilot these. Hmm. 
It took a while on that one. Thelma Ann's writings to text data extract from Iraq appears from the writings of Thumb Domain, father of the Liberation Front. How long has it been since I first saw her voice? Fear not, she said, there will always be plenty. She told me this as I was imbibing Rubicon's blessings one fateful day. For you, I'd never allow this, I replied, and I was forever ashamed about my deceit. This seems to be a recording of Domayan, the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. Hmm. I it's talking about air. Slow guys. Their electricity spikes. Frustrating. Oh, that looked like something I could interact with. They're doing a lot of damage, those little guys. Oh wow, yeah that sounds like a tough level. This data seems valuable too. I'm so glad this is turning into a profitable mission. Let's keep looking, Raven. An older generation of AC. Hmm. I don't know if it's gonna activate. Professor Nagai's log for text data extract from Rec, the lost auto transcription for a voice log recorded by Professor Nagai, the Rubicon Research Institute director. No, the coral tide is rising at an abnormal rate. This resonance suggests some kind of mutation. Run the calculations. How much time do we have? 47 hours, 2 minutes, 16 seconds. We still have time. Deploy IBIS. According to the timestamp, this was recorded two days before the fires of IBIS. This seems to be about the warning signs of the calamity, right before it struck. Hmm. This is going to take us all the way back to the area with the uh, shield from the original mission where we were down here. Let's see, I think there might be at least one or two more enemies. Yep. Something. Inspecting data. It's a schematic for an SG craft. Cool. Let's see, I suppose that there's nothing down there, we'll keep going. Who's next? Flamethrower wielding robots, they really don't hold up to their own medicine for very long. Oh, is this a new area? Another old research institute I see. First learned guy's log two. The last auto transcription for a voice log recorded by Professor Nagai, the Rubicon Research Institute director. 
Assistant number one has lost his mind. His research has utterly consumed him. Granted, there may be some logic to see Paul's sensory augmentation to human subjects, but no ethical scholar would dare, ever dare, cross that point of return. Mankind is driven mad by possibilities. What does Coral represent, if not sheer potential? This is about the first augmented humans. The same Coral technology that created you. But without it, we never would have made contact. I'm not picking up any more data stores. If this outing has made you think about Rubicon's past or the nature of oh. Coral, then it was all worth it. Ah, the end of the mission. Shoot, I wonder what's down here. Didn't get to it in time. I might replay that one and go get it. We got ourselves a deal, Handler Walter. Michigan. So, Archibus met us halfway? I gave them the heavy warship fleet. In exchange, Balaam's in charge of putting down the beast. They also offered some top Vespers. <laughs> Guess they don't trust us. Better than nothing. I'll provide what support I can, too. Yeah, you're mad scientists. R.E.D. or whatever. And that hound of yours. Michigan. Don't underestimate 621. That hound always delivers. What kept you, 621? You're a famous mercenary now. Time to act like one. <sighs> this next mission's all or nothing. Make sure you attend the briefing. Oh, cool. Prototype issued V60SNA. Octopus Corporation's issue with the following prototype part shoulder weapon and stun needle launcher. Neat. Advanced development vision. Nice. Let's uh, see if we can get that equipped, and I do want to go back into that mission, anyways, and uh, try to get. Uh, Let's see, total rounds. I want to try to get um, that thing that was sitting there hanging around that I couldn't get before because I let it pass me by. Let's see, does it have it on both sides? No, just one. Let's read about this in case there's a tip. Anti ice worm weapon designed by Archivus ADV neutralizes coral shielding with electrical interference by firing a mass electrified needle to create a powerful discharge at a point of impact. Nice. That sounds like it's going to be cool. Alright. Let's get in here and uh, try it out. Oh, let's do replay. And we want to go to this one. Okay, I think I'm equipped as I want to be, so let's go ahead and do it. I'm going to be able to move through it a little bit more quickly this time, since I know where things are roughly. Main system, activating combat mode. Let's get started, Raven. I've already located several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. <laughs> oh, that just like melted. That's cool. PCA craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send them to your reader. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the racks back online. 
Let's see what we can find. See how these guys are just waiting to activate. See them hanging out. They won't actually fight me yet, though. There they are. <laughs> and that thing is overpowering. Hilarious. That's an old bow CC. The Rubiconians used to pilot these. This All right. seems to be a recording of Dolion, the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. generation of AC. According to the timestamp, this was recorded two days before the fires of Ibis. This seems to be oh, about the signs this one of the calamity, time. right before it struck. Hmm. What are other robots I've missed? This area does look like there's a ton of nooks and crannies and things to be laying around in. <laughs> Overkill. This data seems valuable too. Okay, I'm getting close to that bot that was down that elevator shaft area. Pick up its data or whatever logs it may have. Man, that needler just obliterates them. It's crazy. I think it's actually this elevator shaft. So let's go back up and look. This data should some light in the wow, it's for 60,000 squads. It seems like easy money. or anything to collect money from, so it's like this might be the last guy. Another old research institute I see. This is about the first augmented humans. The same coral technology that created you. But without it, we never would have made contact. I'm not picking up any more data stores. If this outing nice. has made you think about Leo's past or the nature of Coral, then it was all worth it. Oh, cool. Bet I got a B rank. Yep. Nice. I felt like a B run. See if there are any cool parts to buy. Looks like still plenty of things to pick up. 
Let's see, actually, what was that thing here at the bottom? Oh, it's this larger pulse gun. Let me go ahead and snag it while I'm at it. I think it's only on that arm. And let's keep going. Let's see, this one's 275. Wow. Seems like it zips around pretty fast, so. Cool. New arms for 310. I think I'll go ahead and buy it as well. That'll put me down to next to no money. Um, let's see about our AC design real fast in case there's anything we want to modify for the next round. But it's really hard to beat this current setup. Uh, let's see. This looks like it has exceptional defenses though. Weight is so high though. I think you'd have to put that on a tank just about. It's crazy. 11,300 to 26,740. Man. Okay. Well, we'll just keep acquiring parts and uh, maybe we'll get everything one of these days. We'll go ahead and roll credits for the moment though and say thanks for watching. This has been STR Inc. Follow me on Mastodon, Twitch, and YouTube, and I'll have a stream recording up on YouTube soon. Thanks and have a good one.